Is this a double kappa maca frappuccino from the place I like down the road? Extra shot, soy and milk, low fat decaf. <clears throat> oh, we're on. Sorry. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of What's the Big Idea with me, George Hill. We've been talking to some of the brightest young minds in the country to help us find clever ways of powering Ireland into the future. Today, we're going to hear from Orla Sheridan from Cavan, and she's going to tell me about some people power. Well, it's over to you, Orla. Thanks, George. If I was the government and my job was to think of a clever way to provide energy for our homes, schools, hospitals and factories, my plan would be to have power from the people centres in our communities. The centres would have rows and rows of exercise machines. The machines would be linked up to an electricity grid and would store the energy created by people exercising. It would help our communities in so many ways. There would be less lonely people because they would all meet all their neighbours as the creative power for the community. If someone was unemployed, they would be able to spend more time at the energy centre and feel important that they were powering the community. With all this exercise, everybody would be much healthier. They would use less electricity at home. They could get a receipt for energy created at the centre to use against their energy bills. The PFTP centres might not create much electrical energy, but will create lots of positive energy. Thanks, and back to you, George. Thanks, Orla. And that's another great idea of how to keep Ireland powered into the future. Well, that's all we have time for today on What's the Big Idea with George Hook and, of course, our guest, Orla Sheridan, who's going to keep us powered. For more information, log on to tellthefuture.com.